All right, hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome to Plant Daddy. Also, accompanied by Desktop Goose. Don't go to the, my other window. No, come back. There's nothing for you over there. Well, it'll be back. <laughs> M Goose Hog. <laughs> I love it. All right. Anyway, I am Plant Daddy. I don't know what to do. Uh, can I can I get rid of this? Oh, it actually opened up my notebook. <laughs> no, come back. <laughs> this is the shop. There are two currencies, leaves and blossoms. You can see how many you have on the bottom left. Leaves are for buying plants, and blossoms are for buying furniture and doodads. Speaking of fathers, uh, click on an item to see its description. Click it again to buy it. Buy garden plant. And, well, I have no choice. Buy the garden plants. Cool. Bam. Great, you little guy soaking up the sun. Click on your plant again to take a look at it. Get out of there. Get... No. No. Alright. Well, this is a problem. Okay. So, garden plant. Move stash name. I'm going to name this one, um... We're going to call this one Inferior Plant Son, uh, because like all good dads, I'm nothing but disappointed in all of my offspring. So your plant is charged and ready to grow. It's It made leaves while it was charging. Collect them by clicking the leaf button on the left. He's ready. Water your plant. He's grown. What do we add at our pot color? You now have enough leaves to buy another plant. Your plants will take about 1.5 minutes to charge. Feel free to close the tab or switch away from it. Well, they're charging. Everything saves automatically. Just pop back in later. That's not how this works. Okay, so I could buy some other things. What do we have? What the... What is the goose do... Well, I'm just... I'm gonna leave that there. <laughs> uh, let's see. Well... There's no good place to put this, so I guess I'm just gonna leave it there. Uh, let's see. So, do we have more? Because presumably... Okay, growing fast. Alright, so we get... I see. Needs a bigger pot. Ooh. Okay. Pot style mace. How do I get a bigger pot? Gotta be something here. Is it... The cardboard boxes. None of these seem like pots to me. Watering cans, inventory settings, volume. I am unsure of how to repot my plant. Oh, pot size. Here we go. There we go. I'm sorry. It's a little distracting. Uh, let, let's go with sleek. Aw. Thank you. Thank you, Goose. Nope. <laughs> How do you like goose drifting? Alright. Well, we're just gonna kick back for a little while. I feel like I should turn on some of my own music. Let's turn on some music to go with this. Because I'm liking... Well, no, actually. I think that would actually... I think that would betray the, the state of this game. Oh, it's raining. It's been raining outside. All day, day to day. On and off? Oh, Green blossoms. Unfortunately, we don't need blossoms. I need, I need another flower. I guess what we could do, go back to plants. What did he do? Why is he tracking in? I am confused. I kind of want to go for the forest sprig, but I feel like that's going to take a little bit of time. Get, get out of this. What are you doing? Nope. Well, all right. Wonder no closing stuff makes the goose angry. I'm quite aware, but there's only so much I can do. Wait, I can unlock bathroom. <laughs> That's all right. Ooh, I'm gonna have to unpack this at some point. Hold stew plants. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Seeing as stuff growing is gonna take too much freaking time. Let's see. 
Ah, there it is. Your to-do list. Click it to take a look. Where? Oh, this. You can earn extra blossoms by doing extra uh, doing tasks from your list. Try the first task. You can use the camera tool on the top right to take screenshots. I wonder if that actually includes the goose. I kind of hope it does. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're doubling up on honks here. <laughs> Uh, well. Go down in here. Bring the honks over. Inferior plant son. And his twin honks. Take picture. Do we actually... Do we actually get a screenshot? I'm not sure. One way or another, I, I need to get rid of some of these. Poor sucker is going to be upset at me. Alright. Holy Crow, Prairie Star, Forest Sprig. Name one of your plants. <laughs> uh, life stuff. Need Wi-Fi. Potting soil, spray bottle. Uh, guess a main? Only drink socially. Should I drink socially? I'd have to take a bit of a, a sidestep to do so. Uh, let's see. I don't know if we need bigger or smaller plant sizes. How much does it cost to open that window up? I don't actually know. Let's go back to this. Open up ordered window costs three. Well, it doesn't seem like I can do it normally, so I guess I've got a shop to do so. Ah, open window costs ten. We could get a bookcase. Get the bookcase. And let's, let's keep picking up basic garden plants. I should probably go for the Garden Star. Get out of here. This is not good work. This is bad work. I feel terrible. Okay. Nope. That's enough for a Prairie Star. Hey. I'm going to keep... Uh, let's go for the Forest Spring. I'm going to keep dodging the goose. Because I can. Grab some water. You need a bigger pot. They always need bigger pots. That's just how this works. Uh, I just like the sleek. It looks good. Like there's just something joyous about it. Uh, let's make this one... Green feels wrong. I don't like these gray. I think the gray works. I have a very gray furniture in my own house. And I'm totally fine with this. Alright. So I don't have much for... What did you do? Whenever it gets the brown footprints, I'm afraid it just poops somewhere and I'm a little worried. <laughs> I'm really glad we have a goose to uh, to accompany us on this little journey. Right, how long do you... Yeah, it takes a while for these to grow. But you? I wonder if the more plants we have, the longer it takes. Probably the case. Okay, so fully grow either and then open up the window. Unfortunately, that will take some time. Uh, okay. Here comes a biggin. <laughs> oh man I yep nothing more needs to be said right, so what other plants can we work towards a lot of these are real expensive we keep going for the plant cubbies I could I should Okay, so it looks like I can only have so much. Let's go inventory furniture. Get the plant cubbies down. There we go. Ugh. Ugh. I don't like that. Alright, we're, we're just going to stash the plant cubbies. So I got three points. We need ten to get in there. Do I go for... Oh, this is inventory. I got six now, so let's get a prairie star. Oh, I can rotate. I have no idea. Let's go back to this guy.
move this over here. Try playing Nova Drift with Desktop Goose. Uh, we... <laughs> We absolutely... That is the sound effect from, uh, Space Station Silicon what? Valley. It's gotta be. Wait. Weird bad idea. Aw. Oh. I was really hoping I could somehow... Wait! <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it turns out having this many geese makes things real laggy. <laughs> how do I stop it? Oh no. I actually do not I do not know how to stop this. Uh, nope, that's the desktop. That's not it. Uh, that only made things worse. Hot. Oh. Task manager. Okay. I must slay the goose. I have too many. I have too many goose desktops. Oh god, the memes. They float. Uh. Uh. I have no idea which of these is the original goose. I right, we can we can safely endure two geese. <laughs> Peace was never an option. <laughs> that was perfect. All right. Oh boy. That was not what I was expecting to get when I moved that away. Oh, that is so perfect. I just moved the honks over and it's like, eh. Also, thank you, Coldheart57, for the three-month resub. Came here after watching your video on the itch.io bundle. Thanks for taking a stand and letting people know uh, about an awesome, awesome initiative, Wander. Hope you continue speaking up. I will try. It's really hard for me to speak, about, speak up about stuff that kind of matters. Uh... I spent last night... Oh, hey, we got that. Hey, we can get the other window open. Perfect. Now get out of here. It's telling, it's telling me peace is never an option again. This goose... This goose is aggressive. Might have been the other one. Anyway, let's get rid of the honks. Now he's double mad. But, now we got two windows. Aha! Let's see. Put up some art. Have three plants growing on shelves. Fully grow a cactus or a curling vine. Uh, let's see. But yeah, it's always one of those where uh, I I think I've been a little timid, uh, too timid maybe, uh, about talking about things that matter to me. Uh, I love it that I can actually see what the goose is going to bring on before you guys get to. It kind of ruins the reaction, but I am an agent of chaos. Yeah, you are. Who's tough now, little goose? These must be the geese from Untitled Goose Game. It's gotta be. I have no idea if it's the same people. I'm pretty sure it isn't. Kitschy posters, 25. Ugh, bathroom mirror. Seriously, do we not have any better art than this? No. We got a lot of plant, uh, shells to put plants on. Well, do I save up for the cactus? Actually, uh, cactus isn't terrible. I think I want to go for some more prairie stars or garden plants. Which one are you? I think this is actually just a, uh, just another garden plant. Yeah, mm, eh, hmm, we'll see. I will figure it out. They're wandering over there. Uh, let's see. So, right, talking about things that matter to me and so on and so forth. So, I've always been a little bit timid about doing so. Uh-oh. This is having problems. I'm goose honk. And also honks. I feel like uh, two geese maybe is too much. But that that is okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, the main question is, do I get more plants? 
Or do we save up for the better stuff? Let's probably just pick up the basic ones. Eh. Get another prairie star. I'll put it over here. This will be the blue pot. Everything will be sleek, though. I like I like sleek. There we go. Uh, but yeah, so my family is has always been kind of contentious about talking about things that mattered. They're both mad. What are you going to do? Fight for my cursor? <laughs> it's teleporting between the two of them. <laughs> uh, but. My grandfather on my dad's side was always kind of an opinionated man, and his children were too. And so when he passed away years ago, gosh, two decades ago, uh, I don't think he'd talked to like half of his children for the multiple years leading up to it. And it was kind of terrible. And as a kid, I knew that that was like tragic, but I didn't really understand why. Uh, but I just knew that it was like talking about something that you care about is not necessarily a good thing. And I think that one just stuck with me. So I've always been... Uh, I've always been a little, like, leery of talking openly about, like, things that I'm immediately passionate about. Unless I'm around people that I know that uh, won't hate me uh, for having that opinion. But the problem with that sort of thing is that you end up just kind of living in an echo... Echo chamber? Uh, and everybody only hangs out with the people that will agree with him. And I think that sort of thing is kind of a dangerous mentality. And also, uh, the other thing is, from a YouTube perspective, obviously this is my job, and the more people I alienate, the worse my job is going to be. Um, and any time that I have tried to talk about, you know, my feelings on the matter, I always get a bunch of people that are just like, you know, how dare you? Or like, you know, they're just kind of mad. Uh, so a long time ago, I was talking about how... I don't like Papa John's. I'll still talk about this. Get out of here. I wonder if I can actually... What are you going to do, geese? Fight me? You may try, but I will spin you right round. There we go. Uh, so I was talking about how, like, I don't care for Papa John's. Even, like, even now, after they fired, you know, Papa John or whatever his actual name is. I have no idea what his actual name is. But even after they fired him, they only fired him because he was specifically, like, bad for business. Uh, you know, that he was no longer uh, making the money. So they got rid of him because they wanted to try and rebuild the brand instead of having the guy hold it back. Uh, which, like, okay, better late than never, but that's still, that's still like, bare minimum uh, what you can do to actually rectify a situation. And I'm, I still have not forgave them? I'd say forgive them, but, like, I don't care. At this point, they're dead to me as a company. Um, which is mildly tragic. And, uh, mildly. I don't actually care that much. <laughs> I cause problems on purpose. This is truth. Wait, can I change these? <laughs> eaten 40 pizzas this past 30 days. Gosh. If that's actually true, you should probably introduce a little bit of variety into your diet just for your own health. I I hope that's not true. Buy a cactus. Let's put the cactus down. Um, But, so I remember talking about this years ago just in terms of how it's, like, kind of dystopic. Uh, it's kind of dystopic uh, to, you know, pay people poorly and treat people poorly and just like a bunch of other stuff. Nope, get out of here with that conk. I like I like these geese. We're starting to loop, which is the unfortunate part, but that's okay. But I just remember uh, talking about that and being like, yeah, I think everybody deserves a living wage and, you know, just really basic things that I think everybody should probably agree with. And I had more than, a, more than a few people mad at me saying that, no, we need shitty jobs to somehow, like, teach people the meaning of business, or I don't even know. And it was just kind of terrible. And afterwards, I was just like, okay, don't talk about this stuff. And I realized nowadays, no, that just means they won. 
like, whether or not they actually proved a point there, by the fact that I learned, like, don't talk about this sort of thing, it means that this, this jerkwad won. And I hate that. So I'm going to try and talk about things a little bit more. Especially for things that truly matter. Like, I'm not going to... Well, I don't know. I'll probably get a little preachy here and there. I'm going to keep talking about my meat alternatives, because I've been... I've been eating more and more uh, Beyond bur Burgers lately, and they're so good. Let's see, quick question, Wander. When you draw, do you draw with a mouse or do you have a draw pad? I have a Cintiq. Uh, so I've got a... Uh, I've got a... Uh, shoot, the Cintiq. What am I going to say? I don't even remember what the name of it is. It's the, the current one. I think it's $650, but it's, it's a 16-inch screen. Um, that you can actually just draw and you plug into your computers and stuff. And it's so good. Uh, it's so good. I like that good work, Goose. All right. I will admit this game's starting to lose me a little bit. It's charming. The geese are hilarious. I will try this again when the geese are 1.0. Uh, currently, they are version 0.3, uh, which means they only have so many memes they can throw around. Which is really cute. Is he going to try and defend it? Is he going to react? Okay, here's a question. He's going to start bringing something in. Nope, he's just tracking mud. Dang. I was going to say, if he was going to bring something in, what happens if I close one of his previous things? Does he get mad? And the answer is, don't know. All right, one way or another, this is a cute game, but I was hoping there would be a little bit more uh, daddy and a little bit less watching plants grow. Uh, but I should have known better. This is absolutely, I think, the kind of game that you'd load up if you're working on something else and you just kind of want a very low-key idle game to have running in the background.